Lovely people, see what is happening. We all know that um, a new king um, in Oyo state has been installed. But before the king sat on the seat, we saw that um, uh, Pastor E.A. E. Adeboye sat on the seat first. That's the picture there. That's the king and his wife standing, you know, on the other side. Pastor E.A. Adeboye sat on the seat first. And, you know, they've been waggling their tail and tongue like, a, you know, like, you know, the puppy sees the, the owner. They begin to, you know, waggle, waggle their tails and, you know, and jump for excitement. So it's caused a lot of controversies on social media with everybody asking uh, why will the king permit, you know, the monarch permit that uh, Pastor E. Adeboe sit on the on the seat and i'm saying him my dear you don't understand probably is the is the king that say you have to sit here first before i sit here don't forget that that very monarch was supposed to be uh was supposed to be a pastor yes and he resigned to say you know what i want to i want to do this work first of all please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe let's get all the details miss reactions trail pictures of Pastor E. E. Adeboye sitting on Oyo Monarch's throne. A picture of the General Vasier of the Redeemed Christian Church of God, Pastor Enoch Adeboye, sitting on the throne of the Olubo of Igba in Oyo State. Oba Francis Akimbola has drawn a lot of attention from social media users. The picture which was first posted on X on Friday by the Redeemed Christian Church of God Public Relations has since generated different reactions from social media users. Why some citizens condemn the clergy for sitting on the monarch's throne, others blame the king for permitting it, saying it is an ancestral throne. It is a throne for the ancient and not just where you should permit a pastor to sit. Reporting the report, reposting the photo on X on Sunday, an X user Anu Olua wrote, Pastor Ia Deboye, can you imagine? He was telling Pastor Ia Deboye to stop disgracing our heritage, that he is a real or your son. Do your thing, eh? respect our culture, and let us do our thing. Don't tarnish the name of our, our, our gods. You have built because your Yoruba stand is against this act. You are not a Christian, so you don't want any other person to practice what they believe. Another one said, my stand on this is that Baba Deboye is doing this intentionally to ridicule the Yoruba or Baship. If you feel disgusted about this, it's time for you to speak up. This is an abomination. And that person said, condemning the post. Another Twitter user says, I feel the blame should be placed under the feet of the Olubo, Olu, who on what basis will he stand up for his, from his throne and allow Baba Deboye to sit? He should have just the throne and let Baba Deboye be the king. And I said, I don't mind him. I don't have him to blame. I blame our so-called Obas who have decided to subject themselves to ridicules. Why would an Oba vacate his seat, stand up, and Pastor Deboye will sit on the seat? Does that mean, he, is that the respect he's looking for? And I'll say, posting the picture on Facebook, um, I see nothing wrong. I see nothing, but I see nothing wrong. He's just, um, he's just, a, my dear, some, some people wrote unthinkable things. I will not, I will, there's no everything I will read. You know, another one said, Pastor Debo is an ordinary man and is not a ghost, but he placed himself in the position of a god by sitting on the throne of the traditional king. It is no doubt that God comes first. Pastor Debo is not God. So if you want to position yourself as God, you are not God. And that one said, the Bible says that we are kings and, and with Christ. So Pastor Debo is a king because he has the king of kings on his side. Uh, another one says, Pastor Debo on Friday took his church evangelism program. Let's go out fishing to Cyrilary in Lagos. So, I mean, people have different opinion. 
But let me tell you something. The king was the one who stood for Pastor Adeboye. For him to stand for that Pastor Adeboye, he did it intentionally. Don't think Pastor Adeboye told him, you know, stand up and he stood up. No. He intentionally asked Pastor Adeboye to sit on that seat. So people who are waggling their tongue and all that, I just feel you are just wasting your time to be quite candid because the man wanted Pastor Adeboye to sit on that seat. Do you know what people are going through? You sit on the seat and you cannot stand up again, you know. So he knows exactly what he's doing. He knows, okay? It's for him to say, Pastor Adeboye should sit on that seat. He knows, you know. So it, it's, it's, really, it's really, really glary. It's clear for all to see that, you know, uh, this is the next line of action. You know, this is what is going on. And everybody should understand it. You know, that uh, as it stands at the moment, we're not going to sit back there and allow, you know, the same thing over and over again. Pastor Deboye, you know, was given the rightful position to sit there by this very, you know, the, the person itself was the one that says, sit on my seat. So why is everybody, you know, uh, now blaming Pastor Deboye? Okay, why is everybody, you know, blaming Pastor Deboye? So this is what is happening. This is what is going on. Well, my lovely, wonderful people, can we please uh, make sure that we do not speak on what we should not be speaking on and we do what is right, okay? And do what is right and what is needed, okay? To ensure that we, we are the, at, at every point in time, we are doing the right thing and we are, you know, we are standing for what is, what is true, you know? He, 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 Pastor David will not just go there and sit there. He won't. Just take it from me. Okay, he won't just go there and sit there. Okay, so it's 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 really it's really mm -hmm. unfortunate that some people just feel, you know, that um, they can just speak and speak and speak, you know, because they feel like speaking. Okay, so it 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 is what it is. It is what it is. Anyway, my lovely, wonderful people, don't forget that Nigeria, you know, we need. So my people, this is it. Okay, so let's not. Uh, Let's not uh, go and just be crying over spilled milk. Ah, Pastor Deboe sat on the seat. He did not sit on the seat. You know, they, he, he knew. He was the one that would have said, uh, Rabbi Deboe, sit on this seat before I sit there. So I don't think it's something that, uh, you know, we should, we should uh, you know, go ahead and begin to weep over and cry over and say, you know, it must be this, it must be that. Okay? So my people... Let's call it speedy speed. Leave us a comment. God bless. Bye for now.